remember the good old days. Can you flash me some lingerie? <laughs> Welcome to the happiest place on the internet. Blue, let me make my bed. Move out the way. Oh my god, ew. There's like a bathing suit thing here. But hello and welcome to the happiest place on the internet. Girl, my name is Adeline Warren and today I'm going to be doing a huge haul of things that I've been collecting during quarantine because my toxic trait is online shopping when I am bored. This is this thumbnail. Let me take it off because you guys yell at me every time I put packages on my bed, but I promise you these packages, oh, they've been like sitting in my apartment for like a couple days, so all the germs should be off. Look at Blue in the background. She's like, I will dig in the pier. Mom, you mix it going. I am going to dig in that pier. First things first, I feel like quarantine has made me realize two things. One, I overthink a lot. I've been thinking way too much for my own good. Trap do with only my thoughts and two my only hobby is spending money and I need to get other hobbies so recently I've been like picking up like in the morning I try to walk blue I've been trying to meditate I've been believe it or not Adeline Warren has been meal prepping trying to eat a bit healthier trying to focus on me during this quarantine because I feel like that's the only thing that we can really do like you can't control a lot of things especially right now but you can control like your morning routine your night routine and stuff like that but one thing that I just didn't have in LA is a good nice pair of sneakers I got these from drip creations they're so cool. They have so many different like butterfly patterns. But since I moved to the beach, <laughs> I need to stop with that accent. I got these wave Air Force ones. And I think that they're just cute. I love the blue. They're probably like, I don't know. There's so many yellow ones. Why didn't you get the yellow one? I just feel like the wave and the blue will go with jeans very well. And they'll just go with every single outfit. And it's very just beachy vibes. Wear with a bikini and nothing else. Oh, hello. Oh, look. And they sent it to me. So thank you, Drip Creations, for sending over something else that I have been really loving. Girl, <laughs> I don't talk about deodorant often. But when I do, I only use secret. This is the secret with essential oils deodorant. I've been using secret since like high school It's like the only deodorant that works for me. I swear to god like I am so sweaty Especially recently. I don't know if my body has changed But I've been sweating a lot recently and the only thing that really helps me tame it is the secret I don't even have to say this. I'm disgusting like, But it's true. Why have I been sweating so much more recently? Lavender and eucalyptus, but it just has like a very luxurious smell bad bitch energy smell um, But also just protects you against sweat. It's also paraben and dye free which is great and it's available online now so you guys can totally shop in the link down below thank you so much secret for sponsoring today's video but yeah boom pew pew pow my dream team for sweaty armpits <laughs> i just imagine like margot robbie on her yacht pouring some good old lemonade for her husband wolf of wall street <laughs> That's who I envision this as a person. Back to our regularly scheduled bad bitch program. Wait, actually, no, let's do this. This was one of my most exciting orders that I've got. You know who a real influencer is? A real influencer is Sierra. She could sell me air. I would buy her air. Sierra, girl, I'm talking to you. <laughs> I saw her do like a try on bathing suit, clothing haul, whatever on her vlog channel. She said it was like sponsored by Nasty Gal and she just like convinced me to get everything that she got. Well, I got like two bathing suits, I think the same as hers, but so many online companies have been having like 50% off sales. I remember I got all of these. I think I'm pretty sure 40% off sale, like super good sale. And I don't know, Megan and I moved to the beach if you guys have watched my vlogs. And I have a couple bathing suits, but recently I've just like closet purged and I got rid of a bunch of stuff. So didn't have, I, had, I was lacking in this section of bikinis and beach wear, which is what I want to wear that is the new vibe of 2020 so my god number one I don't wear animal print often sometimes it just looks cheap to me like whenever I see animal print I'm just like Carol Baskin killed her husband whacked him I thought that this one was really cute it's kind of like high-waisted and the top is so confusing at first I put it on the top on my as my bottoms but it's just this like kind of crisscross X pattern for your boobies and I think it just looks really good on tan skin tones next I got this white and black polka dot bathing suit and I just think that they're so flattering on your body just like I don't know I don't love high-waisted bathing suits but these just have long straps so they kind of like kind of like hourglass figure your body and this just has a lot of spray tan on it so that's why it's brown this what this bathing suit is the reason why I even put the order in in the first place I saw it in Sierra's haul and I was like oh it was so cute and at first they only had size zero and I was like man I'm like not gonna fit in a size zero like what am I gonna do and then someday I checked the website again and there was my size in it and I was like that's it I'm ordering right now check out honey whatever <laughs> everything but it's this one piece bathing suit and girl I know it doesn't look much holding it but on the body oh it's just like I feel like one pieces are really a hit or a miss either it's really flattering or it's really not but this just like really makes you have an hourglass figure it makes the boobies look good makes the hips look good kind of makes the butt look good too and this belt just cinches you at the waist and oh all the right places oh she just oh 
tuxedo you win. Ah! I love this bathing suit. Literally the whole reason why I ordered from Nasty God and it did not disappoint. Another bathing suit that I got, Kate, okay, this looked white on the website. This is not white! I should have probably read it, but on the picture I was like, eh, this is cute. And it was on sale, but this is like a, a minty colored bathing suit. And it has a really long strap, so you kind of double it on your stomach. But I don't know. She had an after eight. She had a crest white strip. Oh, so minty, so fresh. That's just what it reminds me of. I don't know. I like it. And, okay, so back in New York, I was with my friend Haley, and she was like, Adeline, you need to get a backless top. Backless tops just like draw the eye to the back, down to the butt, mix your but like oh so peachy so nice so good so ooh, grab a <laughs> I need to relax so I just saw this this was on sale and I was like oh you know what I've been needing a backless bodysuit for the longest time I just feel like it has a turtleneck it's very classy and then in the back you're like oh hello it has these little crisscross drops I don't know I'm kind of excited about it have my what's that guy from Apple Hey Google, who is that guy from Apple? Here is some information from the web that might possibly help. Jobs and Wozniak. Steve Jobs. <laughs> okay, Google, stop. Okay, Google. Stop. Thank you. She was going off. Have my Steve Jobs moment, you know what I mean? Steve Jobs would make it ho. Steve Jobs would make it fashion. Oh! Now, these tops have been so trendy recently. I've seen them all over Instagram. It's just this cardigan and it has a little tie at the front. Girl, I'm telling you, once I got this in the mail, I wore it for like three days straight. I was obsessed with it and I still am. I'm gonna bring it back to Canada when I go. I just think it's so cute. It just reminds me of Jennifer Aniston. It's like classy cardigan, but a little bit of a booby moment. And I got a couple other cardigans. This one's yellow. I mean, how could I not? You know what I mean? I think it could be cute. There's three buttons if you just button that top one and it's kind of like, oh, my little lemon moment. And then I just wanted a nice yellow bathing suit and sometimes you know as I said one pieces are just so classy They're so good for when you just ate a little bit some maybe you had like a barbecue You're gonna have some like hot dogs or some ribs I don't know This is just good for that has and this one's cute because it kind of looks like a two-piece with a little cut in the middle The middle and again, I wanted very beachy outfit So I got this two-piece and it just has shorts and this little tube top that you can tie up I thought this would be a good beach cover-up and every gal just needs a good old red bikini. I don't know why, but every time I see a red bikini, it just reminds me of Alexis Red and that Jay Alvarez summer circa 2018 moment. Oh, when they were a couple, Snapchat just started having filters. No, it was like Snapchat before the update. Those were the good old days. I don't know why. It just like brings me that nostalgia and it makes me really happy. I'm like, do you come with me? I just like imagine myself in Bali, frolicking around, Santorini, Greece. My boyfriend like recording my butt in the water. <laughs> Love that red moment and then another i ordered so much that i got two packages but i'm gonna tell you how much the total was and you're gonna be surprised i mean it's it was a lot but it was 40 percent off so it would have been more i hate my brain shoes i got three pairs of shoes number one i have been wearing a lot of sandals recently because obviously we knew you live near the beach take a shot every time adeline mentions that she lives near the beach i'm just really happy okay i've been wanting to do it for a really long time and finally did it stop judging me i got these white sandals i just thought they were cute you know every morning take blue out to go take a shit so so I thought it could be good to slap on some of these. I have some Birkenstocks, but they're in black. These are just white, you know, different color, different vibe, brighter, lighter, summery. I don't know. 10 out of 10 recommend for taking your dog to go out and shit. Number two, I don't know what compelled me. I don't know why I, I, I don't know what made me want this. I think just with quarantine, I've been on Pinterest more. I've been looking at these outfits that these bloggers wear and they always have these like freaking cowboy boots. I hate country music. The only one that I kind of like is like that BB works one ones ago. If it's meant to be, it'll be, it'll, I don't know. I don't know. I wanted to have my Miley Cyrus Hannah Montana moment. I just, I thought that this could be cute. Like imagine some jean shorts, like a white top and I'm shorty. So I need some heels. I don't know. I don't have any, I have like some black booties, but not any white ones. I've been trying to wear a little bit less black and more white, more color. These boots were meant for listening to Ariana Grande and Madison Beer. That's just what they'll do. And then shoot number three. Now I was even surprised to myself when I ordered this, but I'm like, oh, I feel like I elevated my style with these shoes. I feel like shoes are the type of thing where they can make your look lazy or they can make your look look fancy. And these are the fancy shoes. I wore this outfit with some jean shorts and that white 
cardigan crop top and I just looked so fancy when I put it on and then I dressed it down with these and the, it completely transformed the look into a very casual I don't know I think that I think these are called mules is that what they're called they're like these sandal flip-flops and I thought that they would be really good to just dress up any look I have like some sundresses in my closet already so I thought that that would be good for those kind of outfits and they're very beachy they're not like super uncomfortable because the heel is kind of big not like stilettos I hate stilettos my stylist Brandon always tries to get me to wear those skinny stilettos whenever I go out to events and he's always like they make such a difference and I'm like I know but I literally want to die when I wear stilettos so these ones are kind of blocky I feel like they'll be easier to walk in and these tops have been super into oh she's inside out I wore this a couple times it's just this what is it called ruche ruche this ruching I remember I saw this top in Aritzia and it was the color white they didn't have my size and I was like it's okay I'm just gonna order online they were sold out online and I tried to find it in different stores and I couldn't find it in different stores and I tried to find the one that I originally saw I was like hey it doesn't matter if it's not in my size I'll just like make it work and I couldn't find it and then I finally found it on nasty God, and I was so happy I don't know, I feel like ruches just make your body look so nice and curvy and hugs you in all the right places cardigan I wanted another cardigan that way I can button up one of them and be like oh just threw this on I'm so classy speaking of classy I got some lingerie <laughs> they were on sale too and like you know I'm not seeing anyone right now and that's okay society makes us think that we need to be in a relationship at all times but it's also good to focus on yourself and just be single and it's fun to be single and just like wear some good old bralettes and underwear that just make you feel good sometimes it's good to just look at yourself in the mirror and be like i tap that that looks good good for you keep doing you boo i also thought that this would be cute underneath the cardigans just having a little bit of a lace pop out and these are cute because they have little hearts on them where the nipples go and this little matching thong and they were on sale so i just got two of them this is just a plain white one with underwear not a thong and then the last thing that i got from nasty gal is i feel like every girl just needs a little black dress and surprisingly i I don't have a little black dress. I have black dresses, don't get me wrong, but not just a simple little black dress. So I thought this would be really good. I just need to go to a girl's bachelorette party on a yacht, <laughs> somebody's birthday, go into the club. You like, I don't know, black dress makes you look nice and skinny. I thought that this would be flattering. I love the spaghetti straps. It has a little slit right here in the leg, that asymmetrical moment. I don't know. I thought that it, it was on sale. So I was like, I just need a little black dress, super simple really love that one okay more shoes when you thought that I didn't need any more there's more okay naked wolf they're like my favorite shoe brand in the entire world they're just so great for my girls who are small my small girls that need a little bit of height once in a while so I got these I have white naked wolf I think I have, I have like white black or no I have white nude another pair of white they're just such good staple running shoe sneakers and they're just like such great quality I got these black running shoes and girl I I swear to God, boys never compliment me. Boys never talk to me. The only time boys ever talk to me is they're like, sweet kicks, nice shoes, where'd you get them? And I'm like, what? I feel like boys just, they know to shoes. And these are kind of unique. Like multiple times I've been wearing Naked Wolf shoes and guys go up to me and they're like, where'd you get your shoes from? And I'm like, what? And I saw them, I'm like, Naked Wolf. And they're like, oh my God, cool, does it come in guys? And I'm like, yeah, they come in guys. That's all I am saying, ladies. I feel like boys know to shoes more than girls know to shoes. Or at least I don't, I feel like I don't really know to shoes. But I'd be wearing these and boys be hitting me up. I mean, maybe they don't think I'm cute. They think my shoes are cute, but it's just nice having that interaction and like, you know what I mean? <laughs> I'm so lonely in quarantine. <laughs> I don't stop. You're manifesting that. I am very loved to surround myself with people that I love. I am psycho. But I don't know. I just thought that these were really cute. I don't have any black ones. You know, some days you just want to wear black. Even though I'm trying to wear black less often, especially during the summer. It's so fun to just wear white and color. Sometimes you just need a good old black moment. Just need to wear black leggings, black top, black shoes, all blacked out, and you just feel good about yourself. So I got these, and they have a little bit of a heel in them, and Ariana Grande wears these shoes. I like to wear those shoes. Ariana Grande is also the ultimate influencer. Next up, this isn't really clothing, but I thought that this was just funny. And since this is like a quarantine haul, I thought that I would throw this in there. But I got a package from Elix. You're like, what's Elix? It's a beer company. I've never gotten a beer PR package before, but look at this. This is beer. They have like the fake Clorox. Oh my God, my nail just fell off. I need to glue it back on. I feel like all the boys have left at this point. Ladies, how have you been doing without nails, hair, and eyelash extensions? I'm going my roots are driving me insane. I'm wearing these press on nails right now. No eyelash extensions. I mean, I don't mind. I feel like I go in phases where I love eyelash extensions and where I don't love them. I'm just like wearing makeup right now and lashes. I'm going crazy. 
I need to get my hair done or I'm gonna go insane. I'm like debating even doing it myself. And you guys saw, if you saw my last video, it was like 22 things I learned at 22 and I said, never dye your own hair. I got myself debating whether I should do it. I don't know how long I could live with this. Also, this is my apple. <laughs> I was eating it earlier. But ladies, those of you who usually get their nails done, their hair done, their lashes done, just know that I am praying for you. I hope that you're learning to do things yourself because we really, we're really out here. You know, I'm praying for you, girl. Hope you're doing well. Okay, let's go back to the hall. This is like a hand sanitizer and like isolation craft beer, like wash your hands beer. And then this, I don't really, this is like a stay at home wine. I'm so excited for this wine. It's a white wine. I just thought that it was way too cute to not put in the haul. I know it's like a clothing haul, but they ship online. If you guys are into that. Oh, Elix, thank you for the PR package. Speaking of alcohol, White Fox is the cutest. They sent over a little care package. Look at this. First of all, they have a little note, handwritten. Mm. I don't know, I feel like handwritten notes are just so underrated. Really put the effort in. My acts of service love language is really coming out right now. But White Fox sent over this margarita kit and it has like this shaker, a lime, a little glass straw, the margarita. I just thought it was really cute. And with that, oh, sorry, sorry, baby, sorry. Oh, I scared her. They sent over some bikinis. Ah! White Fox has the best quality bathing suit. So I got this magenta one. It's very Barbie. I feel like this like purpley pink magenta looks really good on tan skin tones. I feel like everyone just needs a good old classic black bathing suit. It has that like ribbed material and the rose gold little... I don't know what they're called. Aglets of bathing suits, I don't really know. Thank you, White Fox. I've never made a margarita before, but I'll try. And then the last thing comes from my stylist, Brandon. If you guys watch my vlogs, one day I decided I have so many Girls Sporting Girls PR packages. I just wanna, like, there's no traffic in LA, which is so rare. I just wanna deliver it to my friends and like, I don't even have to see them. I'm just gonna deliver on their front doorsteps, social distancing in play. So I did that and my friend, my stylist, Brandon, he was like, I have some things for you. And I was like, oh, do you want to trade things for a girl's friend girl said? He was like, yeah. So he gave me a couple things. I showed this in my vlogs. If you've already seen the vlog, you know what I'm going to show you. got this American custom top. I got some bathing suits from Triangle. It's the little bag that it comes in. Brandon is always like, whenever I see something yellow, Adeline, I grab it for you and only you. And my friend is so but this yellow floral bathing suit I think is super cute. It just says triangle on the back. Ta -da! Do you guys remember when everybody would wear triangle bathing suits? I feel like people still do, but I love the ruching. And then another set that I got is this ombre. It's like a yellow to pink bathing suit. And I was texting Brandon today. He was like, yeah, Adeline, I got you that small bathing suit because I wanted you to show up if it was be a little hoe. And I was like, Brandon, I knew you did that for a reason. Because I swear to God, guys, this literally only covers my nipple. But <laughs> it's really cute. I just, I love Love the the gradient i think it's very trendy and cute and if you guys saw i had like a magazine cover with beyond fashion magazine and brandon was styling me for it he got me this yellow one piece he, i didn't know that he was gonna give this to me or else i wouldn't have ordered the nasty gal one but now i have two yellow one pieces and then from years of ours i got this purple two-piece set brandon was like what do you need during quarantine you need bathing suits and athleisure that's what you need so <laughs> he really got me in all the good areas who's texting me normally i don't like biker shorts but this one actually is really cute you guys know i'm obsessed with tie-dye and I got this set from cheerleader it's like this pastel tie-dye legging set and lastly he just gave me this I was like Brandon you realize I have no one to wear this for and he's like you just wear it for like cute outfit or, like a cute pic this is from OW Intimate Scandinavia wait I forgot to tell you where this is from oh never mind it has no tag but yeah that was everything that I got it was a sitch just kidding nobody's calling me <laughs> that woke her up but I hope you guys enjoyed the haul and thank you to all the brands that sent me stuff thank you to all the companies that had like 50% off sale. And I hope you guys have a beautiful, magical, wonderful day. I guess I'll see you guys in my next sunny Sunday video. And if you guys are down for it, I'm doing almost, I'm trying to do almost daily vlogs on my vlog channel. So make sure to go check that out. I think by the time that you guys are watching this, I'll be in Canada. I'll be bored, probably doing home decor stuff. I don't know. So make sure to go check that out. Make sure to follow me on my Instagram, my Twitter, my Snapchat, everything like that. Follow Blue on Instagram. I guess I'll see you guys in my next weekly video every sunny Sunday. Have a beautiful, magical, wonderful day. Bye. Mmm. -hmm.